I knew for sure about the racism because I felt that being with him in New York City, whether you couldn't get a cab or even in Los Angeles, being looked at and go, oh my gosh, throwing out a bunch of cash going into a store because you didn't think that they thought that you were going to maybe steal something. This is the same guy whose work is now selling for these millions of dollars and was at the time. Yeah, I mean, he was well known then. And I think that that was something that I really wanted to show in the film, that it didn't matter how much of a celebrity and how famous and how successful he got when he went onto the street, he was still looked at as a black man. And I mean, I feel that we're still dealing with that. I mean, you could be the most successful Hispanic businessman in Arizona and you could, you know, be out on the street and be just, you know, rustled by the police. So, you know, I think that that's something we need to be aware of.